it'll be forever because none of them are out yet as of the fourth but we're taking a day trip now to Nara 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 what was that? Uh, yes we have to go to the station and then take the Osaka loop line and then transfer and it'll be about an hour before we're in Nara yeah some of you guys might know Nara because of the deer park <laughs> We just arrived. We're gonna go look for that. It's about 30 minutes walk. We can only walk. This area is kind of cool. It's like a very wide street on this end and then like kind of thin on that end. And then you can see like mountains and hills on that side, which is kind of cool. Feels very open. It's a bit chilly today. And right now we're headed to a mochi pounding place or just to kind of witness more mochi pounding because yesterday when we or when I got invited to pound some of the mochi I wanted to see more of it with more skill because I was very apparently, very bad apparently the guys who we are seeing the I forgot what the place is called but these dudes are like the fastest mochi pounders ever okay. I'm getting get some? some fresh mochi. Apparently it's still like hot or warm. <laughs> oh, it's still warm. Some mochi. This is actually not matcha mochi despite it being green. It's uh, I don't know, it's like mugwort which gives it natural green coloring and it has red bean inside and it's covered with soybean powder. Take a warm bite. Mmm. Mmm. That's really good. It's not too sweet and it's still warm. I never really have warm mochi. But mochi is like one of my favorite foods. I definitely recommend. I think we're gonna have to buy a box before we leave. And it's cool just to kind of observe. I mean, it's, it, it's a very big spectacle here. Like, there's people crowded. We just had that amazing mochi here at um, Nakatanido, which is, this is actually not very far from the station. From the station, it's like a 10 minute walk and you just walk straight for 10 minutes, follow the crowd, and just walk up straight. You saw the street? The street's pretty popular, I guess. Mochi Pounding apparently stops at 3 p.m. So come here early, get the mochi when it just finishes because it is warm. It's like a nice feeling eating warm mochi. That is if you like mochi. Mochi, by the way, is rice cake. That's the glutinous rice cake. That's why it's so stretchy. If that's not your type of thing, I still advise you to try it because it's good. Right next to the mochi place, we found this shop and we read udon. And last time we tried to get udon, or yesterday, um, it wasn't as purposeful, but today it is. And now we finally are having real udon. So that works, right? Something very interesting about the way they work here since it's like a very small shop. Once you order something, one person says it and it's like an assembly line where everyone repeats it so that it gets to the corner. I don't know. <laughs> and so by the time, you know, when you order it, it just like in two seconds without having to walk all the way from there to here, the order is done. I got myself a katsudon and udon set. This is fried pork cutlets with egg on top. And then we got 
some classic udon over here. Oh man, this looks so good. Where do I start? Mm. Seafood. It's a very light broth. So, it's pretty good. We got some shrimp, mushroom, other types of mushroom. We got a whole egg, scallop, and other goodies. Some fish. So many goodies in here. And then we also have a chicken rice bowl. <laughs> nice and warmed up my rice scale that was a full bowl of rice plus some more because I really like that environment it was very cozy and the food was very filling good delicious homey. very very filling very homey um, grandmas know how to take care of you there's like four grandmas working in there mm -hmm. I feel like there are like a whole bunch of friends who opened up a business yeah and then like lasted like 50 years or something. Yeah. But yeah, that was that was a full bowl of rice and some more. That was really good. Now let's head to the Deer Park. Deer Park in <laughs> our park. Deer. Deer everywhere. Hello. Hello. Hello friends. I'm surprised they're not freaked out. They're like little crackers. You can eat one. <laughs> oh, it's legit just crackers. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it smells like something you could eat. Oh yeah, they smell good. <laughs> yeah, this just smells like food, real human food. Man, look at him being rejected right there. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, that wasn't part of my squad. This is my squad. <laughs> look at the squad. My squad. Come over here. <laughs> they don't care about you. My squad. <laughs> hey, hell yeah. Munch, 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 munch. There's a lot of deer all open. around. It's, yeah, everyone's kind of just walking around. They can bike around. Yeah. There's plenty of deer. You know what kind of deer they are? They are rude deer. <laughs> Half of them are. Well, I mean, I guess with the amount of tourists here trying to feed them these lame crackers, I bet they taste horrible. Let me take the lane. Let me tell you, whoever's selling these is making big profits on tourists and they're doing good because we bought one. <laughs> we bought a whole stack. Not that they're expensive or anything, it's like a dollar. But the deer are so sick of them, you can tell. <laughs> they're chewing them, they're like, ugh, not this They guy. want like a three, three course meal <laughs> and some <laughs> fine dining. <laughs> they're like, ugh, this terrible cracker <laughs> tastes like salad. <laughs> I'm kidding, I don't know what type of deer they are. But we're gonna walk around the park a bit more since it's pretty fun and serene. I tried a face swap with the deer but <laughs> face swap on snapchat but it wasn't working well. The deer, that deer that I kept feeding was mad rude. <laughs> Such ungratefulness. Fun fact, this place is one of the oldest parks in, I think in Japan in general. It certainly doesn't look that old. It looks like all around the park, they have a whole bunch of food stalls. You can see some here. I think there are some shops over there. And then there are even more down there. Some fried chicken. <laughs> um. Ooh. Hot squad goes over there. Like look at the amount of street food here. You can't not be a fatty. Oh, this is so nice. Hashtag Japan, Japan. Got more souvenirs because we can't stop spending money, 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 money. <laughs> yeah, we're probably heading back now. Um, we might be walking because I want to see the, the fan shop, that little small shop that we passed by after we got our food. But um, yeah, we're pretty done with Nara Park or Nara in general. Um, I know we didn't go all over the place. 
mainly the park. But it's a really nice cozy place and I definitely would come again. Definitely recommend if you're coming to Japan, make it like a trip to Nara. And try the mochi. Yeah, and try the mochi. Try the street food here. What? YouTube one. YouTube one. YouTube one. <laughs> I had a little fascination with little kids. <laughs> you have, the, you have your takoyaki face? I, I didn't get the fresh one. Oh. It's kind of a little stuck. How is it? It's good. It's not like the freshest one because you had it like, so it's like kind of sticking to to the surface. The sun is setting. It's a little early to end today, but we are gonna end just because after this, we're gonna go back and try to edit some videos that we haven't gotten to in a while. I hope you enjoyed our trip here, coming to Nara seeing some deer, trying some mochi, seeing the mochi pounding, and just walking around, I guess, in this very chill environment. I hope you like this background behind us because it's very pretty. The sun is setting and it will get dark soon. And tomorrow we have another trip to make. You guys will see it then. So as always, take my words with grain of rice. Got some late editing going on. Got the, got the tea, got the hard drive. <laughs> Got the bum look. <laughs> Got another hard drive. You know how many hard drives this kid has? Got the... Hook it up with the hard drives. Got, got the late stuff. Oh my god, you have another one in there? We have four on the table. What are we editing? What are we editing? What are we... Some old, some old stuff by now. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, by now, yeah. Japan day one. Yokohama. Oh, wait, is it? What day are we on? We're on like day 10. Like right now is day 10 of our Japan trip. Shut up, you're editing your Canada vlogs that are one month late. <laughs> one month late, Canada right here. Hey, at least we're editing already while we're still in Japan. Hopefully we could get this out before our trip ends. That's why we're starting, but um, it's like 9 p.m. Time to get to editing, time to get to editing. Yeah, I, no paparazzi please, I gotta edit. <laughs>